So here's the thing. A couple years ago, I think it was all the way back in 2016, Kodak announced that they were coming up with a new 8mm camera. And filmmakers were like, okay, this is cool. And it was kind of around the time when uh, Polaroids were becoming a thing. Um, it seemed there was a resurgence in interest of analog technology, but with a digital twist. The Kodak Super 8 millimeter camera was going to have a viewfinder where you could view roughly what the picture was going to look like based on, you know, the stock and everything that you had. And everyone's like, okay, this is cool. And the price for development was going to be included in the price of the film cartridge. And so it was in, all the way back in 2016, they said, oh yeah, expect it next year. Next year happens, and we don't hear anything. And we keep looking for updates, we sign up for it, and then what happens? Nothing. But then two years later, about 2018, 2019, we get them saying, hey guys, it's still going to happen, but guess what? It's going to be $2,000 rather than the 400 or 700 we initially said it'd be. And people were kind of like bummed, but at the same time like, okay, well, we're still going to get an analog film camera, so or a digital camera that shoots analog or whatever. But anyway, so what happened is they say it's still happening. And then time goes by and nothing happens. But then we get this thing of Kodak setting up a convert your old pictures into digital thing. Like they set up a service for that. And it kind of felt like the closest we were ever going to get. And what I think happened was Kodak didn't realize the infrastructure they would need for developing the film. And they hadn't thought that through, didn't realize it wasn't the 80s anymore. And so they kind of quietly backtracked on things. And so, you know, I just wish they would have flat out said, hey, we're not going to do this camera. You know, we thought it'd be a good idea, but yeah, my bad. But they just left everybody hanging. And, I mean, that feels like something you would do in high school or something. But this is a respectable company that did this. So, oh well. What are you going to do?